What's up guys? Anna Mae and I are over here at the cabinet shop today and this is... Joy. She's an 18 inch doll, like the American Girl doll. And we are going to build a school desk for her. Why do we need to build this, Anna Mae? Because I don't have the doll school yet and I have a school bag right here with her and I need her to do school. She'll be homeschooled. So we are gonna build her a school desk today using this beautiful alder wood and we've got her sitting up on this can which will be approximately four inches is uh, somewhere in the three to four inch range is where the chairs for these dolls are made which we will be making a chair but that will be in the next video today we are only going to have enough time to build the desk so I've got her set up here. We're gonna take a few measurements and decide exactly the dimensions and the style that we're gonna build this desk. So we've decided that the desk height needs to be around six inches or so tall. And the way we're gonna design this desk is it's gonna have one leg coming down on this side and then we're gonna build a cubby on the right side. Okay, so we're gonna start out by taking our full three quarter inch pieces and we are gonna run them through this table saw, which I have already done here to get our thickness. This is about a six inch wide or so board. The saw blade goes up about six, uh, three and an eighth inches. So we'll run it through one side, flip it over, run it through the other side. Now we can carry it over here to our 60 grit uh, sandpaper run the orbital over this, and you'll have a nice smooth piece like this to start your work from. All right, now that Anna Mae and I have our two pieces of wood milled down to the proper thickness and all sanded down to, we've got them sanded all the way to 150, we're gonna have, go ahead and cut our legs so this one's gonna have a leg on each side. So we're gonna have one here on this side. And then the other side, we're gonna have a cubby. So we're gonna need to have two legs and then two short pieces that will make the shelves in that cubby. So we're gonna go over here to the chop saw and we'll cut those up. All right, guys, the next step we're gonna take is our legs. We're gonna cut them down to five inches wide so that they will recess in a little bit on the front and the back of the desk. And we're gonna take our other scrap to make our shelves and we're gonna run them through the saw at two inches wide to cut our two shelves. Here's the general layout of the desk and these two shelves I've cut right here will go in this side and then here is the back. So we're gonna, this measures six inches and we're gonna cut the back to six and a quarter. And then that's as far down as it's gonna go because we're gonna make some little legs on here, which I'll show you in a minute. And then these two shelves, we're gonna need to cut them down to five inches over here on our chop saw. And we'll be right back here. So the final touch we're gonna do before we start assembly is I have scribed some lines right here that we are gonna cut out with the jigsaw so when it sets down on the ground, it'll be a foot here and a foot here. And then the shelf bottom will be at that height right here. Well, I don't like those sharp edges right there. So I found this little uh, dry erase marker and I'm gonna use that and I'll show you how I'm actually going to uh, set it right here like this. And I'm going to scribe a circle around there to cut out with a jigsaw to make it a little bit cooler of a look. Let me mark those real quick and I will hold it up here and show you exactly how it looks like. So then we can just cut that out with the jigsaw and sand that down with our uh, 3M sander here and soften the edges and it'll give it a really neat look. Let's take this over here to this uh, little sander right here. We will perfect the uh, roundness in these corners. Miss, what have, what are you doing? Drawing. All right, we're putting our shelves together right now. 
We've got the back end and one of the lower shelves. I've got the other shelf marked out. We're putting it in here and then we're just putting one inch pin nails through here to hold it. And we are gluing it in. Stick the glue right here like this. We will line this up and shoot a pin in, flip it over this way and shoot a pin in to hold the shelf in for us. Get everything squared up there and put a few pins in here just to hold it till the glue dries. And there we have the side cubby, which the desk will fit on top of just like this. And then our other side is going to go just like this. Mm -hmm. So we will be attaching those right now in just a second. All right, Anna Mae is putting the wood putty in there right now. Gotta fill in the cracks. All right, guys, we're about to attach the cubby to the desk and then the leg to the desk. I'm just putting plenty of glue on here so that it will hold it primarily right here. I've got me some uh, pilot, some little marks here for exactly where it's gonna sit so we don't smear, smear our glue everywhere. See if I can flip it over here without making too much of a mess. We'll stick this leg under here temporarily. We haven't glued it yet, but it's just gonna hold it while I plug up my air hose to my pin nailer. Now, let's get some glue over here on our other leg. Find which side's the prettiest. I think it's that one. And we're going to line that up again. All right, now that we've got the desk completely built, let's flip it around here and show you. There's the desk right there with the cubbies. We just need to let the glue completely set up before we mess with it too much. And Anna Mae and I are gonna fill these little pinholes with the uh, famous wood filler. Mm -hmm. It's like a solvent-based filler that dries really quick, really good. I love using it on wood. Something that you're gonna stain and uh, clear rather than something you're gonna paint. Now I'm gonna do the final sanding on our desk. All right, guys, thanks for watching Anna Mae and I's video of building this beautiful desk for her doll Joy back here. And if you like what you've seen, make sure you go down there to the bottom and smash that subscribe button. Turn on the post notifications so you don't miss any more of our videos. Hopefully in the next video, we're gonna be making her a chair so she can sit at this desk. And I will see y'all in the next video.